Uh, this weekend was um, kind of you know a typical UNI soccer this season weekend for us. We uh, uh, were a bit of a Jekyll and Hyde team, and on Friday we played North Dakota State and um, and played very well against a team that two years ago were in the NCAA tournament and tying Texas A&M, and uh, and it's, it's, they've had a good program the last couple of years. But uh, we played very well and um, got off to a good start, scored in the eighth minute. Uh, Shauna Happel, one of our sophomore forwards, scored a, a nice goal. Uh, and we were playing some very good soccer, probably in the first half an hour, probably our best soccer of the season, creating chances and uh, could have had maybe two or three. Um, North Dakota State, because they're a good program and, uh, and well coached, came back into the game, uh, equalized, uh, made it 1-1 in the second half. Uh, and then from then on, probably the game was pretty even, could have gone either way. I, th I thought both teams um, played hard enough to probably deserved not to lose. It, I thought it was going to go to a tie. Uh, we went into overtime and um, and again we went into the first overtime, no goals and uh, into the second overtime and again it looked like it was going to be a tie which uh, in all fairness might have been the, uh, the fairest result. Um, but Charlotte Jones, one of our, again a sophomore uh, midfielder, um, kind of picked the ball up about 30 yards out, took a touch forward and then just hit a an absolute stunning shot right into the top corner. It was, it was one of the best goals um, that I've seen from, from our team, uh, uh, certainly this season and probably ever. It was a, it was a great shot and uh, it was a nice relief. Obviously nice to get a win. We've been working hard. The girls have been working hard all week um, to try to get past this uh, this uh, losing slump that we were in and um, you know the spirits were up and, and they needed a win uh, really to kind of you know confirm uh, the work that they, they had done. So. So it was a great, great win, great night, um, and, and like I said, good to get back in that winning column. But um, uh, we went to South Dakota State yesterday. Um, another good program, well coached. They're a little, little younger than they have in the, been in the past, um, but um, you know, a, a good, a good solid program. Um, we went there and uh, just didn't, uh, didn't really play uh, the way we did on Friday. The energy was low. Uh, the concentration and the focus wasn't quite there, uh, and we got off to a bad start, and uh, it got worse quickly. Um, so uh, a, a loss there yesterday, uh, and a bad loss really, just in terms of uh, again our focus and effort and uh, uh, all those things that you need to to be <coughs> successful in soccer. So we're we're very inconsistent. Uh, our our waveform is uh, a little worrying. Uh, we don't seem to be able to repeat what we do at home uh, away, uh, and that's something that we really need to address as a team. I think we need we'll we'll, we'll meet today, and, and probably talk about those types of things. How can we prepare better away? How can we be more focused when we're playing away? Because as we enter the conference season now, um, the way our conference is, it's so tight. Uh, any team can beat anybody, and, and really, you need to you need to win your home games. And you need to try to get a result away, you know. And, and what I mean, a result, uh, you know, a win or a tie, any type of positive result is very important. And so, um, we start this weekend or on Friday night at Indiana State. We so we go to Indiana State, and we, we need to get a result there. Um, and so we're going to have to be a little bit tougher mentally, um, as well prepared as we possibly can, and um, and really try to get a good result on Friday night. So. So there's things to work on. There's um, there's some bright spots for sure, um, but there's things that we need to address, and um, we plan to do that this week uh, before we head down to uh, Terre Haute on uh, on Thursday night. Any questions on on women's soccer? All right. Thank you very much.